Demo 9.3 Create Requisitions and POs Recall from the previous demos in this chapter that the San Diego plant has 200 t-shirts, the Miami plant has 1500 t-shirts, and Rocky Mountain Bikes has ordered 800 t-shirts. The shipment to RMB must be sent from the San Diego plant because GBI does not have a sufficient quantity of t-shirts in stock. The company must either 1. Purchase more t-shirts from a vendor or 2. Transfer t-shirts from Miami to San Diego. In this demo, we will create two purchase requisitions and two purchase orders. In a later demo, we will use one PO to purchase t-shirts from a vendor and one other to transfer t-shirts from Miami to San Diego. In the purchase requisition menu, select transaction ME51N, create. Enter the data necessary to create a purchase requisition for 1,000 t-shirts to be delivered to the San Diego plant. Then, click the Save icon to save the requisition. The system creates a requisition and displays the requisition number. Make a note of this number, because you will need it in subsequent steps. Repeat the steps necessary to create a second purchase requisition, and then click the Save icon. The system displays the document number. Make note of this new requisition number, and then click the Back button to return to the SAP Easy Access menu. We will now convert one of the two purchase requisitions into a purchase order that will be sent to a vendor. In the Create menu, select Transaction ME21N, Vendor and Supplying Plant Known. The system displays the Create Purchase Order screen. We will create a standard PO to be sent to a vendor, Spy Gear, in the Vendor field. Select one of the requisitions displayed in the Document Overview area and click the Adopt icon. The system automatically copies the data from the selected purchase requisition into the new purchase order. Click the Document Overview Off icon to close the Document Overview panel. Next, enter the gross price of $14.95 and click the Enter icon. Next, click the Save icon to save the purchase order. The system displays a message asking if delivery can be met. It can be met, so click the Enter icon to acknowledge the warning, and then click the Save icon to create the PO. The system creates the purchase order and displays the PO number. Make note of this number, as well as the fact that it is a standard PO. We will now repeat the previous steps to create another PO. Click the Document Overview On icon to display the panel. Next, we will convert the second purchase requisition into a stock transport order to be sent to the Miami plant. Select the second purchase requisition number and click the Adopt icon. Click the Document Overview Off icon to close the panel. All of the necessary data have been correctly transferred from the purchase requisition, so the document can be saved. Click the Save icon to continue. The system creates a stock transport order and displays the STO number. Make note of this number. We will now review the vendor SpyGear account balance in the account menu. Select transaction FK10N, display balances. Enter or search for the vendor number company code and fiscal year fields and then click the execute icon. The system displays a message that states there are no data. This means that there is currently no balance in the customer's account. If there was a balance in the vendor account, then the vendor account balance would be displayed. Demo 9.3 Create Requisitions and POs